has everything. Bumping in, banging. <laughs> Big boy Big neighborhood. Boy. All righty now. Post Malone yeah, is hello. in the Whee! neighborhood. Post Malone, welcome to the neighborhood, my brother. Well, thank you for having me. Man. It is our. Oh, he he up, came in on a day where we did a stunt this morning. Yeah, bro. And mm-hmm. um, we had like a a lot of big ass roaches uh-huh. in the neighborhood. Uh huh. And we've lost a couple of those big ass roaches. <laughs> <laughs> And you should have saw posters like, well, I'm just going to take my bag and throw it out the fucking window in here. <laughs> Y'all can't secure these roaches yeah. in here. Yeah. Yeah. I, I'm kicking it with the homies. I'm up with them crawling on me. And <laughs> yeah. Hey, post, so you don't, you wouldn't mess with no big ass roaches like that? You wouldn't even Hell pick no. it up? It's on site. Oh, yeah. really? Oh, all right. yeah, You're yeah. like, big, I'm going to have to fade yeah. one of these, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? If, yeah. they, if it come out, bro, you're going to lose a count. I'm gonna step yeah, on this yeah, damn thing. For real, that's what I said. How many? You say you got four floating around? Somewhere? Yeah, we we, we came in with 17, and there's four that's still floating around. Yeah. So yeah, we gonna find them. Though. We okay. gonna find them. If not, once you get back, you know, oh towards the God. crib. Oh my It's on your shoulder. Oh my God. Oh, post. That's so cute. Oh, oh. 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 Let, let me give him his reaction. Oh, oh, oh my God. All right. That's what I was looking for. Yeah. And you know, I should just gave it to you from the giddy up. You know what I'm saying? Damn it, you're a guest here. You know what I'm saying? You gotta treat the guest. The right way, man. But first off, we do got to say welcome to the yeah, neighborhood. Yeah, welcome, bro. Thanks for having Show me. Show you, right, man. It's our yeah, pleasure, you know. man. Your what is sound it? effects are so zany. So. Oh, thank you, uh, brother. Thank you. We'll, we'll take us on tour with you, then. Yeah, you back? <laughs> you, you don't need no uh, zany sound effects. <laughs> open That's act. exactly what I mean. <laughs> yeah, you know. But you know what? You probably be one of them cats be like, oh, man, the opening nah, act man. is killing me. Yeah. <laughs> we we got to get they big boy in there. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Imagine. Then when we get off, you know, everybody leave and post is all, you know, postpartum depression and everything so, <laughs> so we, we, we don't need that man what does the business feel like to you and I don't mean business like paperwork and everything right. but just just being Post Malone right now I mean it's weird yeah man it's gotta <laughs> be huh I'm 21 everything happens so fast and you know I'm just uh-huh. I'm taking it day by day did it happen fast where all of a sudden you turn a corner cause it's not like it's over overnight you know what I'm saying right. it's a long ass night right, right, right. that's what I tell people it's overnight that was some long ass right. that was a long ass night but once it kinda took that turn you are probably like damn no I've been I've been making music since I was like 12 see what I'm saying yeah um, you know I taught myself how to play guitar I started making my beats now you learn how to play guitar off a of guitar hero yeah that's where I got that's <laughs> how does that why happen I, I, I don't know that's what you know <laughs> It's good for something. It's yeah, not, it is. It's, not, it's not pointless. You know, and, I get, I and think, your family's probably like, put that guitar down. Yeah, none exactly. Now that it worked, they're like, damn, Playing I'm glad they didn't put it down. Because yeah. <laughs> I played a lot of that, and I did not learn how to play guitar. Yeah. Yeah, no, but I think it's, I think it's good, and I think it's important for people. You know, for especially like you know, like young children or whoever you know would play it. Like, it sparked um, an interest. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it gets dope. them really into part. into music yeah. and like all different types of stuff and. Not just, you know, they have a broad So take spectrum. take me from that to where you start to figure out, like, man, I'm really enjoying this, where you start to create. You know what I'm saying? Because having being intrigued right. and, and kind of taking something and, and running with it and creating, when does that take a turn for you? Well, I mean, it's like I, I started playing, so I taught myself to play, and then I started making beats, and my dad loved my beats. He said, keep on going. Keep I on heard that. Beats. And, um that, that, that was probably like Pops was probably like yeah. Jesus Christ I'm glad you said that <laughs> <laughs> I continue to, I said continue to make beats The fan band, the family gotta be extremely proud yeah, of it though right Yeah I love them Yeah know, yeah Super supportive it, Yeah everybody Once you make it Then everybody Right Had a, had exactly. a hand in yeah. it Like I just met you And I was like man Remember when I gave you that advice Years ago <laughs> <laughs> like, like no 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 B So, so it, as far as now man you, you fast forward When we think of downloads and streams and popularity mm-hmm. you want this point but did is it hard to kind of fathom where you are right now yeah it's crazy i mean um i woke up one day and i had like two million plays on soundcloud like right. during wow. the beginning of everything um you know on on a on a beat that i made on a song that i wrote on you know just it was crazy it was like just to f- see the gratification of everything, right. you know, mm-hmm. like it was super dope. It's like I never expected it to be here. I never expected to have a million followers on Instagram. And um, do you get recognized a lot where you go post? Yeah, I mean, it depends on where I where right. I am. Like if I'm at some like cool little fashion place or whatever. Like, Yo, what's up, dude? <laughs> what's up, bro? What's up, dude? Yeah. Yeah. What's up, bro? Or they try to download you like, I enjoy your music. <laughs> I enjoy your music. Have you always been a fan of music, Post? Yeah, man. My dad, when I was a little kid, my dad put me on everything. Yeah. You know, like from Metallica to Biggie to, to like. You know. And I know you I, You got to love your dad the way you keep bringing him up. 
You know what uh-huh. I'm saying? You got to keep breaking because you. And I'm glad he put you on Biggie too. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's dope. Good Lord, I'm mean, I don't want to call the... you little Yachty before yeah. you. <laughs> <laughs> but I know you love your dad. Dad put you up on everything, and you know he the one who encouraged you to keep going. But at some point, we got to stop thanking him. Right. Because he's going to want something else. Right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> At like, one point. Yeah, so just, you know what I'm saying? Big ups all to yourself. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, because then he's going to be, oh, no more, no more. Right. Yeah, then he's going to want to come and hang out at all, you know, be all up in the videos. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. He could be in the video. I heard that. You and Pops got a good hell. relationship? Yeah, he's dope. He's got swag. He's got a... Uh, what no, did you do him. before music took off? Um, or had, did you always know, like, man, I, I'm going to do music? Was there any gigs beforehand? Yeah, I've I, I done a bunch of stuff. I used to be in a hardcore band. Like a metal band. Really though, playing? Yeah. Where do, where are those guys at now? Uh, I don't know. Shout out to Grant Thompson and Peter Coleman. And you put their last names out there. Yeah. They're probably oh, nice. <laughs> I'm not I'm trying I'm trying to I'm trying to you know, I'm trying to give up uh, that that uh, recognition. Right, 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 right. You, you sure ain't you putting know. the group back right, together. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. We, we can strike <laughs> yeah. a band back there. Yeah. No, no, you're not. You're like, man, that thing say Post Malone up there. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Post Malone alone. When you go into creating an album, right. now that there's an expectation. Is there a pressure to that, or is there? A, are you more comfortable now that you know that there's a fa- fan base, people know who you are? Right. I mean, of course, there's a you know there's a little pressure, mm-hmm. especially coming out with it with it so late after the fact. Right, right, you know, right. I pushed it back so many yeah. times, and that's mm-hmm. why the pushbacks though. Uh, just a bunch of stuff that I was dealing with with other people, like people that I had worked with uh, mm-hmm. previously, mm-hmm. like. Um, no, <laughs> I tried to slip it in there. Yeah. Can we go to court with you when, <laughs> when, when all this comes together? But 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 it's finally here. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, and do you trip off of like when you do get more obstacles? Like at one point when you're trying to get in and trying to get on, there's no obstacles, right? And then it well, there's all obstacles, but right. now it's totally different. Right. It's different now, obstacles than yes. Than what you like man, I wouldn't to have to deal with this if I right. didn't have exactly. You know, hits and people didn't know who I was. So when we do get Stony the album that's available for us right now, man, and you say you know you, you go in with with your headset, you know that you got a fan base, but you also in a position now where you could pick and choose, or there's different collabs that you can mess right. with. Right. Who do you call for the album? Um, we got um Kelani. Yes, hello, I love her. Um, she's dope. She's Has she ever really said anything to you about yeah. me? Uh, <laughs> Has she ever said anything to you like about me, like? Cause I love about her. you. Yeah. Oh, just say no, it. No. Oh, yes. no. Okay. Oh, all right. Yeah. That's the homie. That's the homie. Right. She said her. she said some something like, to me before. Like, what's up? But oh, she yeah, never yeah. said anything about, about me. Okay. Well, it's all gravy. It's all gravy. Don't worry. Yeah, I can bring her. I can bring her up. So you don't lie at all. I mean, to help people and not hurt, and not <laughs> hurt their feelings. Like, all right. So, gosh. Kalani's on the album. Who as well? Kalani Bieber. How long? JB. Yeah, well, that's what we call him. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we, call we call him, him JB. Like we call him Bieber. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, how does that Justin Bieber, how does that relationship start? I love that kid. Yeah, You man. know, um, we got into the studio and we just uh, had a chug off on a nice Bud Light. As you should. Okay. That, that's your beer, right? Yeah. You're going to yeah. mess around and get sponsored. Yeah. You know I'm, I'm trying to. I'm you too should, young, bro. though. They As won't you, let me. Really, though? You have to be 25. Ah. ah. Yeah. 21 to drink it. They just 17, don't. 18, 12 years old at a keg party. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But legally to get in and sponsor and make some wow. money, you got to be 25. Did you say 12? Yeah, yeah. You know, <laughs> you know the little red cup parties and keg parties, man. Come on. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Come on. So, all right. So, so Bieber, that's one of your partners, though. Yeah. yeah. Good dude. Great dude. And you guys Great went dude. on tour together as well. Yeah. What is that Bieber tour like? Different. Yeah, it is, huh? Yeah, it's crazy because it's like going from like two thousand people rooms to twenty thousand people stadiums, bet, and it's bro. plus plus it's like a different, you know, type of type of uh, feel to it. it. It's like it's like young kids and and their grandparents. Yeah, mm-hmm. all the range is so big, mm-hmm. so you don't know if they're gonna like you, but. It went well. It went well. And, and you got to think, but you're not really just coming on straight open and act. It's more tour support too, because. You know, as far as what you bring to the table, you you got it. It's not like cats are just kind of like, oh, walking in and they don't know exactly who right. Post Malone is. Right. But it's, it, it's got to be different what that caliber of a tour looks no, like. No, it's, it's outrageous. They had like 40,000 trucks. Yeah, wow. man. I know that's a lot of trucks. Did, it's, yeah. hyper, that's a lot. it's hyperbole. Hey, but, but you know yeah. what? 
I kind of felt you were exaggerating right. when you said something. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because 40,000 trucks. I'm it's like, dude, where trucks. do you park all these trucks at the venue? <laughs> you know, now I'm starting to not really trust you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, like, you know, like, honest or a liar. Yeah, you, you're, on, you're unraveling over here now. <laughs> all righty, so you go on this tour with Bieber. There's 40,000 trucks. Mm-hmm. The venue holds like 17 million people. Mm-hmm. Is there a pressure <laughs> going out Post Malone every night? It's terrifying. Yeah. It's the worst. Right, right. It's the worst. So it yeah, wasn't terrifying. Right. No, it was it. the best. Because you're playing opposites here. I don't know what you're doing here now. <laughs> I don't even know. I already in the fucking trying interview. trying to figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, but it was a hell of an experience. No, would, you, would you do it again? Yeah, I would do it again. Hell yeah. You know, next time it's going to be mine, though. I heard hey. that. I heard that. Yeah, that gives you something. You know how when you do something and you think you're doing, you, and you're doing well, but then you'll go somewhere else and you'll be like, damn. Like, right. man, like this, yeah, this is, I don't even know anything. I yeah, like this is one check I haven't got yet. Like <laughs> that happened to me before. I was in, I think I was in uh, Denmark, and Travis Scott was supposed to do a show, but he wasn't able to do it. And they take us back to this like the dopest green room thing ever, and they got like customized weed trays and customized everything for and him. I, yeah, for him. Damn, you like he didn't yeah, even this, show up. No, a, I said, you know what? This is I'm trying to get right here. Right, yeah. <laughs> but knowing that he's not showing up, you don't take his tray anyway. I'll be like, man, right? Okay. Like, I'm taking this. Like, this is a waste. Isn't I it? still have your tray. Travis. As you should. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Come and get it. Post Malone, 2017 is pretty much here, man. <clears throat> Are you a New Year's resolution kind of guy? Um. Not really. Mm. I'm perfect. What are you okay. expecting in 2017? <laughs> oh, Hold on. God. Let He's, us live with that for a second. <laughs> He's perfect. That is true. My 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 resolution is to drink more beer. As you should. Drink brother. more you beer. Know, you're 21 years of age. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You, I don't you have much to head, You got a lot it. of beer ahead of you. You know what I'm saying? Like so that, much, That's bro. what you should think. And you don't have any kids, right? No kids. Do you have a girlfriend? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, now, how long have oh. you been with your queen? I like two years. Oh, okay, okay. Mm-hmm. So she's been with you, success and yeah, everything. Yeah, then. yeah, yeah. All righty now. So y'all live together? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, that, that mm-hmm. puts it in perspective yeah. right there. That puts um, it in perspective. I'm a good boy. As you should be. Right. You know what I'm saying? Make make it back to the house. You know right. what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I come in every day. I'm good. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I know I can look my wife right in the eye and I'll be like, hey, you can smell my dick if you want to. <laughs> <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I can say that. You know what I'm saying? Right. It's, a, it's, a, it's a proud thing. You just walk in. Yeah, like, yeah. baby, ain't nothing going down. Ain't nothing. You know? Smell it. Do it. Do, she go, do, she, do your queen go on the road with you? or? Yeah, sometimes. Yeah. 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 Do that, that's stressful. Oh. With her on the road or mm-hmm. like her not being on the road? Her on the road. Because, you know, even though the bus has like a bed in the back, uh-huh. but it's literally just a cubicle. Mm-hmm. And right. It's just like... I need like man room to do like mm. man thing. A- exercises and stuff. Oh. Yeah. Right, right. Stretches. Yeah, yeah stretches. Yeah. Before the show. Does she play guitar or anything? Mm-mm. Well, why is she back there in the master bedroom then? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, she got the, she, yeah, she put got one the of those side bumps. Right. 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 What's going on? Carla coming all back there. Like she like she been in the right. shooting in the right. gym with us. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. She got a writer contract. She don't need all that. Right. You know? yeah, that's what I'm saying. Does it make it different when you do take your queen out? Because even when I go out with my wife, man. <laughs> It makes it different because now you become also like when you by yourself, you can move through. Mm. Now you got to be like, is she cool? You right. got to mess with her. Right. Baby, you yeah, all right? Yeah, you know what exactly. Saying? You got to, you know, check, check. You on stage like, cool. baby, you okay? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, girl. All right. I was looking seriously <laughs> talking to some dude on the side. Yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> is she being robbed in Paris? So many things when, when wow, we're on stage. I'm just saying there's so many things wow. we got to worry about when we're on stage, man. <laughs> now, speaking of that, you do have a relationship with Kanye now that you brought him yeah, up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you want to slide him in there. Yeah. What's that relationship with Kanye? You performed at Kylie's 18th birthday? Yeah. How did they grab you up for that? I don't know. I heard that. You were like, but I was there. <laughs> Hell yeah. What they give you Every to perform time. there, man? Come Free. on, talk to me. Free. Stop it, man. Get out of here. The they Kardashians? Give me, they, they, give me, they make us... I don't even remember they what got like. Was. But I would have I would have done it for free. I, but you know you didn't know. You know what I'm saying? At least you got like a 12 pack. I got somebody. <laughs> That's I do. They bring them in even with the sparkle. Even brother over here like, yeah. man, we didn't go for free. Hey, <laughs> but what's your name again, bro? Dre. Dre. Uh, yeah, oh, it's Dre, my Dre. manager. He, Dre, the ma- ma- manager Dre, like, yes. shh. I'm not here. But, but, but Dre anything. jumped out the chair like, big, come on. No. <laughs> <laughs> if I send the guy over to a Kardashian party for free, now, what, <laughs> what kind of manager would I be? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, come on now. You know what I'm saying? Like, wrong. Yeah. He's just trying to be soft. You know what I'm saying? But, so you don't know what you got paid, but you had to get paid for that. 
I mean, yeah, I guess so. Is that where you met Kanye at? Yeah, that's, oh, that's, what, that's right, right there, where I too. Met exactly. You know, it was super dope because, you know, a couple of dope songs came out of it. Fade came out of it. Oh, my you know, Lord. Um, so what's the relationship with you, yeah. Kanye, and Fade? Um, so... Because, it, you know, I did... Uh, I, I'll tell you off air. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm in the studio every night. Bars. <laughs> bars huh? Told him. You, you know, wrote my part. <laughs> no, not really. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> but yeah, so but but I did get a chance really not to see him build that album, bro. Right. And being in the studio with him is amazing, man. No, he's super dope. He's got a crazy work ethic. Yeah, mm-hmm. that dude is a he is a beast. And you guys got unreleased material as well. Why you won't oh, release damn. it? Who got it? Uh-huh. Man, it's let's just, put it you out. You know, it's timing. Timing my ass. No better time than right now. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? 2017 coming. We got to eat. Right. Let's do it. Hey, I see. This but is going to be a good year. Do you have them? Uh, I think let's so. leak one in Japan. How many yeah, do you man. have? Yeah. 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 Let's leak one let's in Japan. Japan. You got four of them. All right. Ten. ten. This dude got yeah, ten, ten unreleased yeah. songs. Twenty two. He keep putting up. Yeah. How, how many, bro? He got thirty-seven unmixed songs <laughs> with Post Malone and Kanye West. Have you had a chance to talk to Kanye West? No, I haven't. Yeah, I man. haven't. Um, it's tough. You know, it's tough to keep up with the with the phones and stuff. You right. Know? Even if, even for me, and I can't even imagine on his level. So it's like, mm. you know. that's crazy. I wish him the best, though. Yeah, and so yeah. so do I, but. I mean, he has like the same number for like the last couple months. Like, why you? No, <laughs> wow. maybe, uh, like, why you can't call him? You know what I'm saying? Maybe, maybe he you're don't. Not maybe he him. don't answer. Maybe you're not as close to Kanye West <laughs> as you think you are. Post. You can call him. Big? Well, I don't think he likes. Wait, me. Of course, I can call. Oh, him. No, don't say that. Oh, thank you, guys. Yeah. 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 <laughs> He's over here like you don't have the number, bro. You don't have no, the I'm number? just saying that you don't have the number, so it's obvious that you're not in like our elite club. With wow. Kanye. What do I gotta do to get in? What do I gotta do? I have no idea. I eat one of these right now. No, for no, Kanye, no, 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 Kanye's number. I bet you want thousand dollars for your charity. Thousand dollars for your charity. You eat one of those big ass roaches yeah, right now, bro. Do it. It's not Kanye. Sorry. Yeah. Oh yeah, that is true. He said I hear do it for Kanye's right, number. Right. Now why the title stone? You don't get stoned anymore though. No, right? I used to. I used to. You know, blaze hella tree four twenty. Mm-hmm. So. Um, and then what happened? And then I stopped. Somebody what? gave me some funny stuff. And it completely just laced? stopped yeah, you? Ruined. Yeah, it ruined. Yeah. It was laced with something that's else. What, that's, that's what sucks. I think. That's what oh, I think. Wow. You had a bad trip You weren't like it? butt naked yeah, in the desert like, somewhere. No, not like two. that. I just felt like... Also? I, I call my mom, call my dad. Like, Crank? I was oh. just experimenting. I'm like, I'm sorry for everything. Wow. <laughs> mom, what dad. <laughs> I'm going to come home. <laughs> <laughs> and then from that day on, it just never felt right to me. It hurts. Wow. Wow. It had to be Bro. something post that it just made you put the brakes on, though. It's really, it's really terrifying stuff. Really though. Wow. But uh, you know, I, I I smoke going to bed now. But oh, okay. Oh. But, you know, I can't really. You know, four twenty six. Right, right, right. It every day, you know. Right. Um, so, but you 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 will grab something that you know yeah. is yours. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You and go. and, and okay. put yourself to sleep. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought I thought you was completely. Done. You Let's smoke cigarettes? It. Yeah. Go ahead. Now. A lot of them. Damn. Wow. Yes. Yeah, so. Bud Light cigarettes, guitar. It's rock and roll. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Rock this dude, he's yes, a rock, rap, country. You got <laughs> yeah, this dude it. got them all locked in, Jack. <laughs> there's no category that you'll put Post Malone in your music in. Though. I hope so. I hope you know there's not a category. That's what, that's how I feel music should be. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I think people should just make what they like, and you know, what did you like grow up on? I know we were about to touch on that. What, what, what did you kind of grow up on? Um, my dad, you know, mowing the lawn and stuff has a has a, had a lot of uh, like just listening to garage metal in there, like a lot of Metallica, a lot of Megadeth. Um, you know, I, I'm um, my brother and my dad put me on Outkast and, yeah. and Biggie and Pac oh. and Ice T. I heard and, that. Um, my mom put me on country. You know, oh, man. Toby so, Keith, Brad Paisley, all that <laughs> mix stuff, of everything. And just yeah. being that well rounded, though, bro, mm-hmm. that's that's what make a great musician mm-hmm. as well. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? When you could bring so many different elements yeah. and so many different ingredients to the pot, though, because people, you know, need to realize that that everything comes from something. Like mm-hmm. ev- everything comes from one place. Mm-hmm. Like so, it's like you could take take something and put it into this and it would sound great. It just fits, you know? What's the craziest, like, fan moment you think you've had I don't since know. the popularity? I feel like I've, I almost saw a girl die oh, before. Man. Oh, man. She was on, um, it was a show and here's the stage and here was, like, a, a, 
a banister, would you call mm-hmm. it? Mm-hmm. Is that a banister? Yeah, like upper. Yeah. Yes, okay. sir. And she, it was like it was like twenty feet high, high, and she's sitting up there twerking, and like her foot is like literally off the edge, about to just fall in and uh, to her death. Really though, yeah. she didn't Damn. fall though. No, she's alive. Oh, okay, oh, but, but, no, but she didn't fall. <laughs> no, no, she didn't oh. fall. <laughs> Now, were you at a show? Yeah, that was at my show. Do you Damn. stop and say something, or yeah. do you just kind? Of, oh, okay. Yeah. So you probably saved her life then. I didn't tell her to stop. I just said you lit. Oh, 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 oh man. You said you lit. Yeah. <laughs> just turning it up a little bit more. <laughs> hey, baby. You, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> you was too lit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, man, too legit to quit. Rest in peace, honey. We're gonna get some airbrush shirts for you, though. We're gonna get some. We're we gonna get some in memories for you. We definitely got to get some in memories. Twerking girl on the banister. <laughs> yeah, oh. you know what I'm saying? <laughs> twerking could be dangerous for you. I'm going to tell you guys straight up. All right, mm. hashtag twerking. Look at it. There's yes. some crazy videos out there. Are you are you a social media guy, Post? Um, I am more now that, you know, you have the to, album. Huh? Yeah. Um, it's like, I just, I like to uh, just talk shit on there. I heard that. <laughs> oh. Really, though. I just get drunk and, and tweet. Now, um, will you drink today? Will I? Yes. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, okay. He was like, man. It's my party tonight. That's right. Oh, hell oh. Come on down. Let's get weird. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Let's get weird. Why go there? I'm weird here. Right, yeah. You know what I'm saying? We should just have it in here. Yeah, come yeah. down and get weirder. Post, if you could collaborate with anybody dead or alive, who would that be? Um, I want to say Kurt Cobain or, or Johnny Cash. Ooh, or Toby Cash. Keith right now would be super dope. Or... You gave a lot of wars. Oh, right, right, person. Right, right. <laughs> she wants you to keep saying words. She go, oh yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm, I already yeah, have me a too. Really no I... band right now. Right. So we keep Johnny Cash. Can you can you just say Tupac? Like for... Yeah, just say yeah, Tupac yeah, so I can get okay, excited. Okay, there it is. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, no, that would be dope though. Right, 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 right. <laughs> she was like, or. Or, he said, or he said or, more than one. Yeah, yeah. Or, Tupac. or Tupac. Or the answer is Tupac. Or she kept going. Or or Tupac. Oh, Tupac. Yeah. Tupac. oh yeah, Tupac. All right, yeah. There, there, there you go. Do do you see like the uh, you say which which was the country guy you say? Toby, Toby Keith. Toby Keith. Do, do you see Toby, Toby Keith in your lane as far as like man? I I I'll, I'll get to that cat. I mean, I I met him before. We we was actually on his bus on his birthday we jammed for like two hours really? with Damn. the guys who killed osama bin laden oh oh that's with like the military cats when yeah, they came on still team six yeah, i heard six. that how was that it's pretty sick yeah it's <laughs> pretty, yeah, pretty sick do they talk about it like will they like retell stories because they, they, they were all they were all really faded oh. yeah <laughs> you know your love is faded you know? <laughs> <laughs> then she came hold up hold yeah. up you know what I'm <laughs> man but no that that's hell of a do you feel like now you get a pass. Like, is there anyone that you've met where you're like, damn, like, man, I, I, I get I get these passes now. I mean, I, if they want to work, that's super dope. Right. You know, if they, if they, if they, I mean, I'm different. Mm-hmm. I'm a weirdo. So it's like, if you want to, I feel like they would be down, though. Like, right. I feel like me and Toby would make something. You don't set, seem you know jaded I mean? by the whole music business, yeah, though. I'm not, I haven't achieved anything yet. There's nothing I can, you know, I'm just a guy. Really though. Now, now with the White Iverson video, you did that yourself, or I mean, I didn't shoot that video. I'm talking about like content. I'm not. I'm not oh, no, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> everything, oh, everything. Oh, I got yeah, the right Now <laughs> <laughs> my boy uh, yeah. sitting the camera got to run back out <laughs> to the shot. <laughs> <laughs> um, my boy James Defina did it. Really though. So, but it was like like something that it wasn't like hella hella budget as far as like man, we got. I think it was all of like five thousand dollars. Wow. Damn! Wow! <laughs> Look at his manager's like. Just joking. <laughs> Did anybody tell you not to shoot it? Uh, no. Man, <laughs> you need to talk with your manager Dre yeah, over yeah. there. Communication. Yeah, is off. Uh, Natalia, can you get up and put Dre down? <laughs> <laughs> right. Did anybody not believe in the song? It had to be. Uh, yeah, of course. Yeah, there was a bunch of people who was like, "Who the hell is this?" Right. You know? <laughs> And early on, I'm talking about not before it takes off, where right. you're like, man, this is what I have. Right. Is there anybody next to you that's like, oh, okay. I feel like my homies gas me. So, unfortunately, mm. no. Oh, really? It's like, this <laughs> is it. That's awesome. Yo, yo, yo. We need to go we with this. <laughs> yeah. No, nobody Super wanted sauce. me to put the song out, though. Like, I just did it spur of the moment. Like, I made an album art on Photoshop in like five minutes and just put it out. And that was the best thing I've ever done. Damn. Yeah. And where were you working at when things started to take off? In the Palisades. And some, what kind of work? Some, with some dookie heads. Uh, where, what was I working? Heads? Yeah, like, yeah, like yeah. Job wise. Yeah. Oh, I, I didn't had no job. Oh, okay. So I was I was uh, uh, like a professional coin digger. 
Oh. Looking for like quarters and stuff and couches and stuff. Go ahead now. <laughs> yeah, bro. I heard That's that. That's I got man. strong hands. As hey. you should. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you, that business used to be a way lot better too, man. Take it from me when they had right. more pay phones, <laughs> <laughs> more pay phones and like machines. newspaper machines. Like, oh man, it's a struggle now, no, bro. It's tough. It's yeah, tough. it's a you good know? thing this music thing took off for you. It's like it's like taxis and Ubers. You know? but, yeah, it's like true. driving a taxi now. But, so. uh, yeah. Exactly, brother. It's, <laughs> it's, it's a new day. Yeah. It's yeah. a new day. Make way. <laughs> On Stony, from all the tracks that you have there, is there one that you really hope your fans gravitate towards or just absolutely love? Um, You know, there's a bunch of stuff. I can't, I can't really say one track. I could just say that there's a bunch of stuff that I play guitar on, and I think it turned out super dope. It's really fresh. It's, I, think, I, think, I think it's a good direction just for, like, you know, hip hop or, you know, even even any genre. And, mm-hmm. and, and, yeah. What will we learn from you listening to your songs? Uh, Did you open up in any kind of way? Yeah, no, there's some special uh, sensitive songs on there, I guess. Sensitive song. Any, any that you re- wrote for your girl? Uh, no, I just feel like it was about, like, high school issues. Right, right. Yeah. <laughs> right. High school wishes. <laughs> yeah. And then it could be for your girl, like. You know what I'm saying? It could right. be for her, exactly. like. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this, this could be for her. You know what I'm saying? This could be for her. Now, when you going, uh, you want to call her up and propose to her right yeah, now while we here? Yeah, when are you going to drop her? Do it. That's a lot of pressure. <laughs> I think she's asleep right now. Oh, okay. Oh, there she'll be pissed oh, off. She'll be wild. What the yeah, fuck you call her? Yeah, it's <laughs> early. Like, what? What are you doing? You know what I'm saying? Then she probably may be so upset she may say no. You know what I'm saying? She may say no. Y'all it's not the timing ain't right. Go ahead now. Do do you see kids in Post Malone future? I hope so. Hey, your manager like, man. What the what is this? Kids. Therapy? Jay's you know, like, gonna be you're like, like, can we get through the Stony album in the tour first? <laughs> yeah. Like, man, like, what are we asking here? You know what I'm saying? Uh, so, 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 what's going down performance wise now? The it, tour, what's happening? Um, I'll go to London on the 12th. And then New York on the 14th. Where do you like going overseas? Do you have that one place that you like? I love London. Yeah. Amsterdam yeah. was dope too. Oh, yeah. Uh, but is it dope even though you don't smoke or? <laughs> no, they let you smoke cigarettes there too. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I just, you know, have a smoke and a crepe. Yeah. <laughs> smoking the crack. Oh, ooh. Hey. Well, excuse me. Very- smoking a pancake. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Smoking a pancake. Oh, excuse me, Mr. World Traveler. <laughs> Stamps all on your passport. <laughs> I apologize. You know what I'm saying? Do you ever go to the red light district? Nah. Of course you have. No, I've never been. Yes, you have. Come on, man. You've been to the red light district in Amsterdam. You You didn't even walk by. Yes, you have. I promise. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, Can't he's a do good that. boy, remember? Nah, my ass. Because <laughs> anybody that know about Amsterdam know that even the shops that you go to, even if you want to smoke, Ooh. is in the red light district. Wow. There it is. That whole little area mm. is a red light district. Oh, I Got thought you, you was talking about the naked ladies in the windows. That's what you ah, went, that's where you went to. How'd you know they were naked? They got naked ladies yeah. in windows over there? What? Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. Where? I was, I was over Ooh, there. That's, with that's, that's what I heard. I've never uh, been there, though. Uh, Oh, okay. Because you <laughs> just hit the stage in the cage. Yeah, you yeah, always like, yeah, get me back to the bus. Exactly, exactly. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, so yeah, if anybody know anything about this, like yeah. naked ladies in window. I think that's Because I thought I saw a documentary about right. that. Right, yeah. Mm. That's in Amsterdam. Yeah. Oh, okay. Where I you think been? so. I think so. Where you've been, right? Yeah, I've never been there. But not to that part. Not to the Red Light District. I've just been to the restaurant where you can smoke, guys. Hey. There it is. Right there. Oh, okay. <laughs> this girl. Have you been over there? <laughs> no. Nope. Well, why are you talking? But I know it exists. Oh, right, right, right. I day was looking at some of his artwork his over there. Artwork on his right arm. Are you gonna finish that tap that you have right yeah, there? Yeah. Does it go into your elbow? Going on. Yeah. It's just uh, this is me on a horse. Oh, that's nice. you. Yeah. It's like Steve. Do you, you ride horses? Nah, I've never been on a horse. I've been on a horse. But that's you on a horse on your arm. Yeah, and I'm a knight. I'll go ahead okay. now, as you should be. But, this um, looks like something straight out of like Lord of the Rings or Sauron, something. Yeah. How oh, many Sauron. tattoos do you thought, have? Yeah. I have a lot. Just, How many do you have that's finished? Right. <laughs> that's, that's, right. That's, 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 that's really the question. I got to go on tour, man. Yeah. I got to like, go on tour. That's exactly how it is because my, come guy, back. my guy's from Dallas and he, I think he's- You only have one uh, person that you pretty much let? I have two guys. I got His name's Kyle and Ricky and they're super dope. One's from Philly, one's from Dallas. But whenever they're there- I have to get as much done as I can. Yeah. Right. I also have to go to the studio and, you know, do like rapper stuff. Right. <laughs> is the JFK Damn rap one, life. <laughs> is the JFK one just because you're from Dallas and what happened in Dallas with him? No, or? I just think he's a real one. Okay. Go ahead. I, think, I love you, man. I think he's a real one because yeah. he, he was really, I'm a big, like, you know, 
against the machine advocate and um i think he really stood up for like what really america was and mm. like then days after he gave his inspiring speech he got shot it's yeah like, man mm. Where do you where do you think we going now mm-hmm. for the next four years? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I know. I'm just I I just know I'm trying to get this uh, money so I can move out of here and go to Montana. Go ahead and, and build my bunker. So ah. <laughs> wait, hold on, man. So once you get all this money together, <laughs> right? Then you're gonna leave us. No, I'm not leaving. No, you said I'm you're still gonna making build. music. You said you're going but to whenever, Montana. whenever the hit shit hits the fan, I'm gonna have a studio in there. Yeah, Come there on. you go. Right? Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. I got you. So Some then now out. somebody got to go. Probably Dre. He got to go. Management got to go to the bunker, tap on the bunker, <laughs> mm-hmm. get the product. But you know, now when you have your bunker savvy enough, where you can just email. Imagine. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, there, there'll, right. be, there'll be Wi-Fi. Okay, just check it. <laughs> I don't know what Wi-Fi. you had in your bunker. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. You don't know what kind of Armageddon we're gonna have with the right. Wi-Fi. Right? Yeah, oh. you know what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. Maybe, I'm gonna maybe. have to send it through a like bird. That's what I'm saying. Right, right. <laughs> at least, at least. How's your pigeon game? Up. You got your pigeon game yeah. up? Uh, Do you have any pigeons? Falcons. There. Oh, there it is. I should have known. I got to look at the artwork. It all tells a story on his arms. You know what I'm saying? He's a falcon. There's a knight. Yes. And he loves Kennedy. Post Malone. Definitely want to thank you for coming into the neighborhood, hanging out. I enjoyed you, man. I enjoyed yeah, you, man. Can you come back tomorrow? I would love to. All right. <laughs> Just cool get the Bud in Lights on deck. I know. Yeah. You know, it's the truth. I was going to have Bud Lights in here for you, right? It would have been so awesome. Oh, man. Yeah, we dropped the ball on that Damn. one, man. We owe you. Cider. We owe them. Yeah, I'll come over. Well, next time. It's festive. It's next so time good. You no, 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 no. <laughs> no? Never, never say you owe somebody. All right, fine. You know I don't know you nothing. Yeah. Just, just next time. We, we'll try next time. Next time. <laughs> oh, oh, you is like, man, you owe me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay. That, hold it over your head. That's a scary word. Yeah, he'll hold it over our head and <laughs> he'll be at a concert playing. I didn't have my Bud <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> hey, B, you fucking liar. <laughs> <laughs> Never got those Bud Lights. <laughs> <laughs> no, but thank you for coming into the neighborhood. Appreciate yeah, you, brother. Thanks for having and me, And let guys. me tell you, man, stay magical like you mm-hmm. are. I'm trying. You know what I'm saying? I've had a lot of people come and sit in these chairs, man, and they become the most stuck-up pieces of shit mm-hmm. afterwards. You can't. I'm just, you know. You want me to start naming some? <laughs> come on, don't do that. Uh, okay, I will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That big boy guy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. you probably been on the road with somebody like, you're going to go see big boy. Oh, no. Oh. You don't want to go over there. Because <laughs> I noticed when I walked in, you're like, ah, oh, I thought it was big boy from Outcast. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no one told damn. me it was a Y, not an I. Yeah. <laughs> Where's Andre at? Yeah. yeah, that's exactly what he said. Where's Andre? Where's yeah, he was like, well, I'm here. Might as well sit down and yeah. do it anyway. All righty. I don't know who's listening to this guy. But no, thank you for coming to the neighborhood, man. Me, man. My pleasure, man. Stony D album yeah, is available hey. for you right now. I advise you not to pick it up because you're just gonna take the money and go get a bunker. <laughs> no, make sure you guys go grab it, it up, man. No, I appreciate you. Thank Best you, believe man. that. Post Malone in the neighborhood, big boy, big neighborhood. Boy.